Did you know you have the power to transform your health and your life? After years of suffering with undiagnosed autoimmune symptoms, I found myself on an endless loop of expensive supplements, broken promises, and drive through meals. I was a busy working mom struggling with chronic pain. I could no longer keep up with life until I decided to take my health into my own hands. I discovered the healing power of whole foods and incorporated a healthy lifestyle that is simple, affordable, and maintainable even when life gets busy. With easy, whole food meal prep, meal planning, and wellness strategies, I healed my autoimmune symptoms, regained my energy, and lost 30 pounds along the way. I discovered I had the power to change my life, and I know you have that power too. Whether you're looking to reduce inflammation, lose weight, or optimize your health, this is it. Get ready to discover the vibrant life you deserve with the Prepared for Wellness podcast. I'm Ashley Cavolo, and I can't wait to join you on this journey. Hi, you guys. So as promised in the last episode, I mentioned I would talk about my tricks for warding off illness. So if you listen to the last episode, um, you all know that my daughter was sick with a stomach bug and she had all of the symptoms. Within three days, or not three days, it was about two, I was starting to feel like I was coming down with something. I had that um, feeling of the headache, achy joints, sore throat, scratchy throat, excess post-nasal drip, and I was really glad I had recently stocked up on some immune boosting supplements that I had. So I am going to tell you that three days later, which is today, I am beginning to feel a lot better. I woke up yesterday and I could tell things were kind of lifting. Um, So I really believe that these supplements helped me fight whatever this was off. So when you feel sick, your immune system, it needs help. Your white blood cells need all of the support they can get to fight off whatever is trying to take over. Foods that are anti-inflammatory, vitamin C rich, and support the gut can do all of that. So here are some of my favorite ways to ward off illness, and this is exactly what I've been using over the past probably month to two months, uh, and I really think it's been helping. So I kind of created my own immune boosting smoothie. So what I do is I freeze uh, orange slices. I buy the uh, triple colored or the tri-colored frozen carrots. Um, I sliver up ginger and turmeric and I put those in the freezer. Um, So for this smoothie, I'll do the orange and the carrot. Both have vitamin C. I'll add in a sliver of the ginger and turmeric. They're antiviral, antimicrobial, anti-inflammatory. Um, I use a My Kind Organics Turmeric Booster. It's a powder. There's um, the GoBiotics Immune Booster Powder. And then I have been using the Earth Chimp Protein Powder. This has probiotics, zinc, potassium, magnesium. And then I'll do a, ground, a dash of ground cinnamon a dash of ground ginger, and I use coconut milk. Um, So I'll blend that up. It is delicious, and I'll do it uh, at least once a day until I start to feel better, usually in the morning. I'll replace my usual um, morning smoothie with this, and sometimes I'll do it twice a day, once in the morning and then either at lunchtime or later in the day, depending on if I'm home or not. Um, And then the next thing uh, on my list is the Herb Farm Daily Immune Builder. This is something I started taking about three months ago after I had the flu, and I noticed a significant difference in my immune response. This is a holistic blend of herbs and and ingredients like berries, mushrooms, and echinacea. It's a liquid dropper, so one serving is a dropper full. The suggested use is three times per day. I like to put one dropper full into about two ounces of water and I just drink it down. So I'll take a dose in the morning, a dose at lunch, and another after dinner. And I try to stick to the suggested dosage of three times per day, but there are always those busy days. I only get in two doses, but I'm fine with that on those days. It's better than nothing. 
Uh, the next one is a honey propolis spray. I take this on a daily basis as well. Propolis is a substance produced by bees to protect their hive. It is antimicrobial, antifungal, antibacterial, anti-inflammatory, and contains antioxidants. Medical News Today, which is a website, it has a great article about propolis, which I'll share in the show notes if you're interested in learning more. Um, the suggested usage is 20 sprays towards the back of the throat as needed. I've been taking this right along with the immune drops I mentioned a few minutes ago. The texture and flavor is like honey. Um, my local co-op sells Mickleberry Farms brand, which is what I'm using now. But the Beekeepers Naturals is a well-loved brand that you can get in many stores as well as on Amazon. So I'm going to share the Amazon link in the show notes. And then we have the My Kind Organics Turmeric Booster. This is one of the smoothie ingredients I just mentioned. Turmeric is anti-inflammatory, which does wonders for the entire body, reducing inflammation. Uh, it helps the immune system function properly so it can do its job to fight infections. I add one serving to that smoothie. I add it to every morning smoothie every single day. Uh, it doesn't seem to have a flavor, so it does blend really well. My Kind Organics Golden Milk is the next one. Golden Milk has become pretty famous these days. You can find Golden Milk lattes in a lot of coffee shops. This blend is amazing. It is an anti-inflammatory blend of turmeric, ginger, cinnamon, ashwagandha, and other ingredients. It's known for its antioxidant and anti-inflammatory benefits. I love to make golden milk lattes before bed. It is incredibly soothing. I just blend a serving of the powder with some warm coconut milk and cinnamon. And then next up is Ancient Nutrition SBO Priotic Probiotics for Women. We don't think about our gut health when we're sick, but they are very connected. The health of our immune system depends on the health of our gut. So if your gut bacteria is out of balance, you will have more of the bad gut bacteria than the good. This means your body is less able to fight off bacteria and infection, and in return, your immune system must work harder to compensate. It is so important to include a high quality probiotic in your diet to ensure your gut and immune system are functioning properly. My favorite brand is Ancient Nutrition. I'm taking their probiotic for women, but they also have options for everyone. I'll leave a link in the show notes for both. The dosage is two capsules per day. I like to take mine after dinner, and I have yet to experience any uncomfortable side effects. Ancient Nutrition also has an organs blend um, in capsule form. This one is a new one for me and something I wouldn't have jumped to try five years ago. You couldn't have paid me to do it five years ago. But I've done quite a bit of research on the benefits of grass-fed organs and it turns out they are highly nutritious. And organs are not something um, you see commonly in America, but in other countries it's very common. We can get a high dose of iron, folate, zinc, B12, magnesium, and many other nutrients that many of us are deficient in. Ancient Nutrition is a trusted brand that uses nothing but the highest quality organ meats. They freeze dry them and sell them in capsule form. The dosage is six capsules per day. Uh, it's a bit much for me at one time, so I take four in the morning and two after dinner with my probiotic. I buy them directly from the website, but you can also get them on Amazon. Um, so I'll include the Amazon link in the show notes. And the last item on my list is bone broth. Bone broth is one of my favorite secret weapons. It has properties that support the immune system, supports joints and gut health. There are numerous brands at our local co-op and there is something about this stuff that my body just soaks up. It's almost hard to explain, but anytime I have it, it's like my body wakes up and it brings it back to life. So I will either drink a cup a few times a day or I will make a quick soup with whatever veggies I have in the fridge and it tastes just like any other broth, but you're getting so many more benefits. This stuff is just amazing. So any of the supplements I mentioned will support your immune system alone, but together they are a powerhouse. I always recommend getting enough sleep and reducing stress as much as possible. And I tend to give my body a break when I'm sick or fighting an illness, and I will take a few days off from my workouts. I know my body does not want to be pushed during those times, so 
I just listen. Listen to your body and follow its cues. And if you have any immune boosting tips and tricks, I would love to hear them. Send me an email or message me on Instagram. Thank you so much for spending time with me today. I hope this episode helped you in your health journey and just maybe you learned something new. If you love this episode, please leave a review. When you do, you are helping this podcast reach others around the world. Visit my website, preparedforwellness.com to view my coaching offers, free recipes, and so much more. Don't forget to grab your free gift while you're there. Follow me on Instagram at Prepared for Wellness and join my VIP Facebook group, Prepared for Wellness Community. Don't miss out on the fun and special announcements.